Hey, what's going on everyone? This is iReviews back with another video and today I will show you guys some really useful iPhone apps that will make your iPhone more worth its money. Another useful thing is of course the like button. So smash the like button on this video as it helps out a lot. Now these apps are apps that will actually add extra new features to your iPhone, letting you do more with your iPhone and not just like daily apps to use, for example, like to browse the internet or just to browse your social media. These are actually very, very useful. So let's go ahead and start off with the first one. Starting things off with an app called Remini. Now this is an amazing app that will let you bring back to life old pictures or even newer pictures that you have like printed ones and you have scanned them with your iPhone or you just took a picture of that picture then this app allows you to bring them back to life. So it will have the enhanced feature which is this one right here and this one lets you basically bring back to life old picture. So you can see I have one right here of Einstein and you will see right now how it will actually just enhance this picture. So let's just tap here and let's wait for an ad. So this is a free version. It will have a few ads. So just wait for the ad to finish. So once the, the ad has finished, you will have the chance here to enhance the picture. And you will notice here, you can see this is before and this side is the after. So you can see right here how it does really, really enhance this picture and it looks very, very good. So this is very useful. Again, if you have like pictures that are printed and you take a picture of them, this will bring them back to life. You tap right there at the top and this will of course save it under the camera roll of your device. Next up is an app called Scan Thing. Now this app allows you to scan for things, objects or even texts or document. But of course you can scan text and documents with other apps as well and you can do documents simply by using the notes app of your iOS device. But with the objects feature, you will be able to actually scan anything you want and then save them as a PNG file under the camera roll of your device. So here I have my AirPods Pro. So let's just go ahead and take a picture right there and you will see now the result. So here is the scanned object. You can see how good this looks. This is actually really, really awesome. You tap the save button and now you have that saved as a PNG file under the camera roll and you can use it anywhere you want. Next, we have an app called Socratic. Now Socratic is an app that lets you learn and get answers of pretty much anything, whether that be a question or maybe a math problem. All you gotta do is just take a picture of the question. So what you can do here is go to the side and right here you can try an example. So if you don't wanna just take a picture of something, you just wanna first try, you can see right here, you can just select like a question, tap the go button and it will show you all the results regarding that question. So here we have everything Q&A explainers, we have videos, more from web and all that. Or you can just type any question you want. So from here, all you gotta do is just basically type anything you want right here. So let's just type a question here. So here I just typed the question, how big is USA? Just tap for search and you can see it will find everything that we need to know. You can see the answer there. We have related videos. We have of course more from web as well, which is really, really great. So this is very useful, especially for students. Anything you need to know, you can just take a picture of it or even load it from the camera roll and you will get an answer. You can also dictate to it by going right here on the side, which is again, very useful. Next up is PDF Extract. Now this app allows us to extract text from PDF files. So you know that if you have a PDF of an article or something you need, maybe for school or something, it is of course hard and you cannot actually extract the text that's on a PDF file to save it on another file, like for example, a Word or just a simple text file. Now with this app, you just have the import button and you go ahead and just choose the PDF files that you have on your files app. And from here, you can see it will actually extract all the text that's on that PDF. What you can do here is tap the share button. You can share it as a file or as a or as text, or you can just tap right there and it will copy everything here and you can just paste it on notes or anywhere you want to save that. The next app for the video is called Tubio. This is an amazing app and I use it all the time. This allows us to stream videos from YouTube, 
or daily motion or even music or your social from your phone directly to your TV. Now you don't need an Android TV or something like that. All you need is a TV that connects to Wi-Fi. And then of course, just make sure that you have your iPhone and your TV both connected to the same Wi-Fi network. And once they are connected, all you gotta do is just go to YouTube, for example, or anywhere you want and search for any video that you want to actually play and once you've found the video that you want to play, all you gotta do is just tap this little button right there and choose the name here of your TV and then it will start streaming that video directly to your TV. Of course, now that you're streaming videos to your TV using that app, you have this other one called Universal Remote and this allows you to control your TV directly from your iPhone. Again, all you need is, an, is a TV that connects to Wi-Fi. You have both the TV and your iPhone connected to the same Wi-Fi network. You tap right there and tap on Start Scan and this will actually scan your network and will find your TV right there. All you gotta do is just tap and connect your TV to your iPhone and now right here we'll have all the different controls that allow you to easily just control your TV directly from your phone without needing to get up and grab the remote, which is of course very useful. If you tap right there, we'll also have all the numbers and all that stuff. All the controls here, programs, volume, media, everything can be controlled directly from here. You even have there a button to turn off the TV. The next app is an app from Google called Photoscan. Now this is one of the best Photoscan apps that you can get from the App Store. It is absolutely free and it scans very good the pictures that you want to scan. Of course, you have like printed pictures or even a document or something like that. You just point the camera and just go ahead and grab a picture at all the positions that it shows, the circles that it shows on the screen, and then you will have a perfectly scanned photo on your iPhone. Now, what you got here is also a button that allows you to enable glare removal so it will actually remove the glare from pictures when you scan them and make them look really, really good. And last but not least is an app called Unit Converter. This one allows you to basically convert any unit you want. Right here, you have the search bar where you can search for any unit that you want, or you can just go to converter here and you will have things like mass, you have length, volume, speed, time, anything you want. So what you gotta do is just choose one of them and right here we have all the different conversions we can make. So just tap right there and just enter, in this case, the speed. So we have kilometers per second right there. We can change this. So let's just make this let's say miles per hour and you can see 22 miles per hour and it will actually convert them all like this so anything you need to know any like masses length anything will be right here you also have a currency converter right here so if you need to convert any currency then you can do that with this app as well so that is it for this video guys these are some very cool apps and are very very useful that i believe will make your iphone more worth its money as of course they will add extra new features to your iphone letting you do more with your device so thank you guys for watching if you want to download any of these apps you make sure you go ahead and check out the pinned comment you will find all the links there now these apps of course can be downloaded for free from the app store at the time of recording this video they are free if something changes then of course you will have to pay for them so that's basically it. don't forget to leave a like and subscribe for more and i'll see you guys on the next one